Hi there. I'm Cindy Ellis, flute and piccolo player with the Pacific Symphony, and this is my friend Zhang Ali. She's played piano and organ with us several times, and we're going to present a piece for you today by Amy Beach. She was a very interesting woman. She's a New Hampshire native, born in 1867, and she was a prodigy. She could read at age three, and she'd memorized over 40 songs by the time she was one year old. Being a very proper woman at the time, she married at age 18, and thereafter, all of her pieces were uh, written uh, by Mrs. H. H. A. Beach. She never used her first name once she was married. After her physician husband died, she went to Europe to establish herself as a composer and performer, and that was in 1910. She moved back to the United States four years later, and she actually wrote this piece on one of the first years that she was a fellow at the McDowell Colony in 1921. There's a picture of the McDowell Colony, and as it was back in 1921, that you'll be looking at. Um, I find this piece very beautiful. The Hermit Thrush at Morn was actually written for solo piano, but adapted for piccolo and piano. We hope you're staying safe. We miss you very much, and we hope you enjoy this little piece by Amy Beach. <laughs> 